Greetings everyone. In today's video, we will quickly learn how you can prevent plugins installation on your WordPress websites. So basically, we will restrict all users to install any plugins on the website as it cannot be activated. Let's get started. For more WordPress content, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. Now sometimes it might be very useful to stop plugin installation to your WordPress especially when you are using a freelancer and of course if you do not want him to install any plugins. Anyway, to do that, log in to your WordPress dashboard. I am already logged in. Let's go to plugins. So there are no plugins. Let me add one. I will add a file manager plugin. This plugin provides access to all the WordPress files and folders. Install it and activate. So here, anyone could activate the plugin like this. So to prevent installing any plugins, we need some codes. So this code will stop everyone to install any new plugins. The code will check if the plugin is already active or not. If active, it will deactivate it, and if someone tries to activate the plugin, it will not be activated, and show this message. And this code can be used to prevent the installation of multiple plugins. Let's first use the code for a single plugin. Copy the code, and go to Appearance and Theme File Editor and go to theme functions. Scroll down and paste the code. On this code, we need to replace this line with the plugin folder and plugin name. Now to the easiest way to do this is on plugins, right click and go to inspect. Click here and hover to the plugin. So we want this data plugin details. Double click on it, copy it, and replace it here. So it is done. Update file. Let me refresh the plugin page. So you can see the plugin has been deactivated. And if I try to activate it, this message will be displayed, which is this one. Let me delete the plugin. Now let me try to reinstall the plugin as normally as it would have been done. If I try to activate it, this error message will be displayed and the plugin can't be activated. Now. This code works for the one plugin. Let's again try to install another plugin and restrict its activation. I will install this plugin. I will activate it. So now let's restrict both of these plugins. Let's find the data plugin name as earlier. So here is the data plugin. Copy it. So this code was for a single plugin. So we will use this code now. Replace the plugin details here. Likewise, also get the data plugin for file manager. And add it here. Now copy this code. And paste it here. However, please use only one code. So I will replace the code here. Update file. So it is done. Let me refresh this. So this plugin has been deactivated and both of these plugins cannot be activated. So this is how you can prevent anyone to install plugins on your website. However, Please do not forget to replace the plugin folder and plugin file name here. 
If you want to restrict more plugins, simply use commas and add more plugins. Anyway, we hope this video was useful to you. Thank you very much.